Hey guys, uh, we're going to do a little quick test and see how good it is. I've been trying to keep it up on the the shorts on, you know, stuff like that. And we're going to try it on this here. It's just a, a file. But I couldn't find one of my hand brushes thingy, so we're going to use this. We're just going to do a scrape and see what it looks like. don't look horrible don't look hella great but don't look horrible you could tell up here from where it's not been wet make sure y'all can see it up here where it's not been wet you can see what it looked like and now what it looks like Let me wipe it off oh yeah can y'all see the difference I gotta put it where I can see it yeah y'all can see the difference so yeah Let's do this other side. It's a triangle. If y'all couldn't tell. Oh yeah, you can really tell the difference on that. Okay, that makes me want to try this here because it was horrid. This one here was like really, 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 really bad. Actually, pretty darn good compared to, you know, make sure y'all can see. I do not have y'all hooked to my TV. You can tell the difference on the way it looks. Hopefully y'all can tell. Like I said, I do not have y'all hooked to my TV, so what it looks like is what it looks like. Oh yeah, it's got a bit of pitting in it, but this could take care of it, you know. Afterwards, I get my vice that's out there on my porch. Uh, let's see, do I have something? I got some sandpaper. What is that? 60 grit, I think. Let me see if that does anything. I hate the smell of vinegar. This stuff stank. Oh, damn. That looks really, really, really good.
Oh, yeah. That looks really, really good. Hell, I'll even show you all the stuff that I'm using, the type of vinegar. It won't break the bank. In these day and ages, I hope I don't get demonetized for this uh, or anything. But that's what I'm using. It's really, really, really cheap. And you can get a gallon of it. I don't remember the price, but it's at my local grocery store. So, that looks amazing. I wonder if I could get this here to do that on this. Eh. This is not waterproof stuff. I'm going to have to just wait until I get it, all this stuff out of here. And then just throw some of the stuff in there that like, like this where it needs to get up here. You know, drop it all the way down in there. Okay, let's look at it some more. I threw a punch in there after I've done started all this. I think I threw it in, uh, oh, snap. I think it was about 5 o'clock yesterday. And this has been in here for two days. This here, I think, is the second day. No, it'll be the third day. I don't know. Y'all go back on the videos and look when I first dropped the little short video on me pouring the vinegar in here and let me know. That's annoying. But damn. Oh hell, there's words on there. I did not know that. There's words on this. I think one of them said Japan, so it's probably not American. Taiwan. It says Taiwan right there. Yep, that's all the words. It looks pretty darn good. Great. 
Wow. Let's just hope this comes right. That'll make cleaning this a hell of a lot easier. I'm wiping it on my britches. Look at that. I mean, that thing was nasty. I mean... Well... That's how dark it was, but it was rust and now it looks well you can see there's metal oh it's a flat side this side's got the bevel and then this side's just flat i have it right in the freaking middle then oh it's not okay anyways that looks good Now some of these will be a video, like this here, this here will be a video. Um, I'm not too sure about the pacer cutter, let me all know, uh, let me know, because I'm going to stop after this, or unless you guys want me to go back and like really shine this up, try to get this looking a lot better, just, you know, drop them in the comments. I'll go ahead and leave this one alone, just in case y'all want me to do that. This here, I'm not too sure if I want to make a video on it. It is old school, though. I don't know where it's made or anything. We'll do a test, little little test strip on it right quick. Shit's got wet, and now it's all falling apart. Feels really smooth. Holy shit. Can y'all tell the difference? I sure can. Oh. That is actually pretty amazing. Wondered if I ate the rust. Anyways, uh. I don't know if y'all want to see any more of this stuff. I don't know what else I stuck down in there. Oh. Oh, wow. I ain't even done anything to that. And it looked like this. Well, I just pulled it up out of there. Well, y'all see me. Wow. Look at that. I'm literally rubbing the rust off of that. Like I said, I'm literally rubbing the rust off of it. Look at that. I used to think vinegar was bullshit, but 
Well, if you got two days to kill, you know, three days, throw it down in the vinegar and let her sit. Well, let me know if there's anything else. Uh, oh, there's another end of it that what I just had. Oh, rust ain't just ripening off of it. Well, it did off of that. That's rust free. What else is down in here? A couple door hinges. What is that? Oh, it's some files. We got some more uh, round files. Oh, yeah, and there's a tiny little triangle one in there too, somewhere. Oh, evidently there was a chisel in there too. I forgot. Yeah, and the chunks of rust is just coming right off. Yeah. Practically wipe that shit off. Okay, we'll show you real quick. Now, right there's a little bit ain't wanting to come off. Oh, there she went. She popped off. Look at that. Uh, that's the other end. More files. There's that little triangle right there. Come on, she was bad, really bad. Well, it ain't the smallest one I thought I had. I have a smaller one. It must be down in there also. She'll come clean. And it feels like it's got some teeth left on it. That don't look like it's doing hardly anything. Big chunk of rust right there. That's been there. I broke it free. So it ain't all hopes lost on that, yet. What is that? Oh, a pair of pliers. Move it into a different air thing. How long have we been going? Damn, almost 20 minutes. Anywho, uh, is that it? Cause that was the handle for this. Oh, here we go. Huh, <laughs> smacking is a lot of rust coming off of it, just smacking it. That's going to be really fun to get clean. Because you got to get down in all them little bitty holes. And I don't think I got files small enough. There should have been another one in here. I know I put two in here. That was the small one. I had the big one that came, that was already on it. That's the thing that holds it all on, all together. And she might, she might put up a fight. Well, where the hell 
Here they go. There it is. This thing might be easier to get clean. Now there is one thing that I forgot to put in here, which I'll make a whole different thing on it, just because I really, 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 really like those. And that is hand beaters. They're like mixers from back in the day where you actually had to put work in when you're cooking you know you can mix your eggs or mix things for like pies or cake or whatever that's gonna be a fun that one ain't gonna be as bad because i do have some files that will fit down through those and they're in here further that's a pastry cutter if anybody didn't know damn that knife fell down in there son of a monkey hope it don't hold that wood well let me know uh what y'all want to see I will make a video on this, like I said, on the meat grinder. Well, you can probably grind whatever you want. You don't have to have meat. I don't know what else you'd use it for. I don't think running vegetables through it would be very good. Or kids. Or people, period. I don't think that'd be very good. Just trying to make some jokes. You know, ha ha ha. Any who's. Let me know what y'all want to see. I did show you a few things. If you have to, you know, get pencil and paper or pen and paper or take your notes in your phone. On what y'all want to see, drop them in the comments and I'll see what I can do. That way I have some videos. And it'd be not really nice if y'all start sharing it and what not I know some of y'all probably do but I'm starting to get less and less views now for some reason and I know I do some repetitive stuff but well when you kind of own stuff you gotta well, you own your property you gotta kind of do things this here if I get me some deer or cow or pig or something like that you know, I can grind them up, you know, make patties and stuff. This here, you can make your own pies or whatnot. Uh, hand saw, you can cut metal. You can make things. You can file, file your metal. Punch some holes. Cut stuff. Fix stuff. Ooh, she's flash rusty. Oh shit. I'm gonna have to get some oil on this. Get a paper towel. Anyhow, let me know what y'all wanna see me work on first on this stuff. That way, well, I know what y'all wanna watch. Oh, here in just a second, I'll show my face, because some of y'all probably don't even know my face. But it's winter time. It's not like I can go outside yet. Anyways, let me take you out the stand. Okay. Hey, there's my face. Anyhow, um... Drop it in the comments if you think I should, you know, trim it up like right here, my beard and whatnot. 
Maybe y'all can. Oh, damn, vinegar. <coughs> Oof. Anywho, uh, drop it in the comments. Uh, you know, what you want to see on the stuff I showed you there in the vinegar. And what y'all think about me cutting it back to like right here. You know, cut all this here off and all this stuff. Trim my beard back or mustache back. You know, shit like that. So, damn, I'm going to get off here before this vinegar kills me. Anyways, like, comment, subscribe. Till next time, stay weird.